you have a Bontrager wheel set with the rapid drive hub, but it doesn't fit your brand new 12 speed Shimano, well, don't worry. I'll show you how to upgrade to a micro spline free hub body in just a few minutes. So before we get started, be sure you hit that subscribe button down below. That way you can see more videos like this into the future. So the first step in the upgrade is going to be removing your rapid drive free hub body. The nice thing is this is tool free, so you can just yank it right off. Your end cap will come right off and out will come your free hub body. Now it's really important to mention that you be careful because as you can see here, two out of the three stock paws have stayed in the free hub body, but we've got one loner that's inside of the ratchet ring. So we want to be careful not to lose these uh, little paws because that'll limit our ability to put this back together. So go ahead and pull that guy right out and put it aside. Now while we're at it, we're also going to upgrade the pawl system inside of here. So the ratchet ring that's inside of the, uh, the hub can actually accept up to six pawls. So we're going to cross up to six pawls. It's a, a relatively inexpensive upgrade that you can get all your parts from your local Trek store. So the new free hub body that you're going to need, you can see it's a little bit smaller and a little bit different design. And that's to accommodate the new 12 speed setup. So before you actually start this conversion, you'll need to purchase one of these, which is going to be part number 600718. You're also going to need a new end cap, part number W586894. While you're doing the upgrade, it's also going to be worth doing the Paul and Spring upgrade if your free hub body is 54 tooth to bring it up to the 6 Paul 108 tooth. So all you need is an additional 3 Paul kit as well as an additional 3 springs for the additional 3 Pauls. So as you can see it's only about $30 to do this upgrade so if you have a 54 tooth rapid drive hub it's an easy and inexpensive upgrade to 108 teeth. While you're getting that new micro drive set up, you can also upgrade to 108 teeth of engagement from 54 teeth. So let's go ahead and scoot in here and we'll take a look at what we have going on. So we're gonna have some free hub body grease right there. And now we're just gonna have to do a touch of surgery to get everything to cross over. So I'll open the package of our new poles and then open the package of our new springs and it's a good idea to do this in a clean environment but what we'll start off with is going to be prepping our free hub body our new one our micro drive micro spline free hub body for the new pulse and to do that I always start with putting grease into the spring holes so these little holes are actually where the spring that actuates the pawl is going to go into. So put a little, little glob on each. And that's going to be enough so that when we take our spring, and we try to slide it into place using a seal hook. The grease is actually going to do the job of holding on to the spring, making sure it doesn't go away. So now we just have to do this to all six spots on the free hub body. Slide it right in. With all those slid in, we can now put a little bit of grease, not a whole ton, in each of these little cups that are going to retain the paw mechanism. And what we'll do is we'll just hook the paw right into place. Push the spring back. And there we go. Now keep in mind that's going to be sticky because we still have to take 
all the additional grease out because we've over greased the free hub body here. Uh, less is more sometimes in free hub bodies, but more grease when assembly makes putting all these small parts together much, much easier. And so now you can see we're six pole in the new free hub body. So we'll take all of our small parts, put this stuff away. And this is where I'll always take my old rag, kind of go through and see if I can't get a lot of this additional grease off. So that done, we'll fold up the rag nice and flat like that. Do a little swipe mechanism on the inside of each one of these. And then now we're going to be in good shape. So we'll work all these in with our hand before doing it, but you'll see they're all popping right back as we would expect. Now to put the free hub body back on, just toss your finger in the center to keep this spacer that you can see that can move around, keep that even, slide it on, and then just rotate backwards which is gonna allow that to clip into place. And then just take your free hip body end cap, press it right on. And now you've upgraded to micro spline and 108 teeth of engagement. So thanks for watching this video on how to upgrade from the old Shimano HG free hub body to the brand new micro drive free hub body plus do the 108 tooth engagement free hill body upgrade. Thanks for watching. Be sure to hit the thumbs up button if you haven't already. And while you're at it, click the subscribe button down below. That way you can see more videos like this into the future.